off with the colors They kinda tell me what I'm thinking I fell in love with the way we are And the way we lose it There's something different about us And the reason why we stay Hey friends, I have exactly six minutes to get through a really quick Timu haul. And I don't know for sure if I'm gonna be ordering from them again. I don't know, we shall see. Uh, the products are very cheap, but I also have a conflicting thought about like buying things from China. So, you know what I mean. I'm trying to get them all unwrapped so you can see them all. and waiting for Ashley to come back in. I have to take a certain someone to work. Did she? Oh, she hasn't come down the stairs yet. Okay, so I'm trying to take things out so you can kind of see them quicker. There's Chelsea, she's doing her chores. Ashley is watering my plants outside. Um, okay, so we're gonna go really quick here. Um, one, because I have to take her, not to work, I have to take her to an ortho appointment. But also because I want this stuff put away. Um, and the first thing that I will show you, I also need them to get frozen. These are the first things that I got. Isn't there four of these? Yeah. Did one of them fall? Oh, four, okay. So there's my ice pack. They look like little eye patch ones, <laughs> but they're the perfect size for the top right here. They'll fit right inside the bra. They're gonna be frozen and they're just gonna fit perfectly. I've heard that you can't put ice on incisions, but that this area is all bruised and sore and it feels really good. So I've got four of them so we can rotate out or have four going at once. So I got those. They were super cheap compared to Amazon. Then also in relation to my surgery, I got two lanyards, um, just as a little mild TMI, in case you are coming to this video and you didn't know I was having the ladies fixed. What, Chelsea? I can't put it, it will, it just is tight. I'm trying to fix the soap container. It will, just push down on it tighter. I don't want soap to come out, it will work. Um, anyway, I'm having the ladies lifted and reduced um, and when you have drains put in and you get to go shower for the first time, you need to hook your drains to a lanyard hook and put the lanyard around your neck so that the drains are up and don't fall out <laughs> of your body. Um, anything else, Ashley, that is surgery related? I don't think so, right? Okay, so then well, everything else. Yeah. What? The. Oh, the, the, well you're sitting on top of the Legos. We'll show you the Legos at the end, but Ashley, She's dying because she wants to do the Legos. We'll show her. She wants to do the Legos, but we're saving that as something to do with me once I'm kind of feeling up to being on the couch and maybe even in my bed. We could do it we in my bed. We could do it in your bed. We could, we could try it. Okay, so we got another one of these spray bottles. We love these ones because it's like this continuous mist. The other one we got broke. Yeah. Um, and then I got um, another nail kit. Um, everyone loves to just I use all of my pieces. This is my own. I have yeah, you have your own, but you use mine in my office. This is mine, so I'm going to keep that for myself. Um, we got the silicone cups for all the cupcake making and baking that Ashley does. Um, I, we just have had could some burnt be. muffins lately that maybe wouldn't have gotten burnt had we had yeah. silicone. But they're it, cute. It would be. It would have been good for the cake pot too. The cake pops, yes, because you could have just put them right inside here. Yes. And then you could just. Like, and uh, easy, easy um, cleanup as well. So, what else do we got? In terms of kitchen, we got this, uh, what do they call it? The cafe stir, the cafe whisk. I and I'm excited for this. I'm actually, when I get back from taking Abby, I'm going to use this to quickly, I need batteries in it, um, make up a whole bunch of protein uh, creamies to put in the freezer for me to have during my surgery so that I, I know that they're all made the way I like them and someone else can quickly mix it up and bring it up to me. <laughs> so I just got that as an easy stir. Um, what else do we got, Ash? Um, I got this little mat. This know. is for my flat iron. Um, I guess, actually guess I could use it to like clean my makeup brushes because yeah, it's got out. little ridges on it, but it is for um, my hair straightener. I keep burning my table. <laughs> it's not a big deal because it's like a $25 table from Ikea, but um, Jason gets mad when I have it sitting on the table. So this is a perfect little mat to put it on. 
And then I also, in terms of my wonderful new car, I wanted the windshield and the top is a wind window as well. And it's just probably really gonna be hard to get it all clean. Um, and so I got this little attachment thing here. Let's see, Ashley, if we can get this to Girl, go in. You? Well, you'll get the idea. We've got the little wipes that go over the top of it. Like a little hot. Big. Here, we'll just do this really quick. I literally have like one minute before I take Abby. She's probably waiting until I turn this camera off to come down the stairs. <laughs> There we go. There we go. Little microfiber towel that goes over the top. Once I get that hooked on, then I can wipe the window down. So extra. So extra. And then we thought this pillow would be like three times as big. And it was supposed to be really cute on my new couch. It still is. But it still like... is cute, but it's more likely gonna be used. It's a nice little pillow extra laying on the couch, if I'm not gonna lie. And then what else, Ash? Is that it from here? What kind of prompted the idea to actually, you're gonna go lower because you were sitting on top of this. Someone tell me if that isn't identical to the Lego set of said flowers. It did come a little broken. It's not broken, it's just squished. But that doesn't matter because all the Legos, I don't know, I, I, I haven't really opened it up. Um, but they look, I mean, Jacob's is an actual Lego set he gave Haley. Yeah, he, he actually, here. It's looking pretty similar to how Lego does it. It doesn't say Lego on the package, but when I search Legos, this is, what gave this is what, did you just drop it? Yeah. Oh, you're gonna have to clean up all those yeah. flowers. Yeah, it looks very similar, almost identical um, to the kit that Jacob gave Haley. So, we're gonna save this as an activity for us to do together when I am recovering, but feeling a little bit better. But this was only $13 on this website, and it's $60. Are you not seeing the website? Online or at Target. No, I am, Timu. Like, so, I don't know. It, we'll, we'll put this kit together, and I've told the kids, we'll put this kit together if it works and functions as well as Legos. I, I may order the other ones, because there's other flower kits that I'm actually very interested in having. One for every route. Okay, I have to take Abby. All right, I didn't really film when I was out and about. Um, dropped Abby off for her ortho appointment, drove over to our friend's house to drop something off for her. She works for Jason's brother. Um, dropped some product off to her, sat down in her little garden area for a second, and then Abby was like, I'm done. And I was like, ah. Rushed back to get Abby, and then we went to the store and we got some s'mores supplies, um, some marshmallows, and some strawberries. Um, to take to his brother's house on Sunday, the one that is not injured in a motorcycle accident. They just live outside of town about an hour um, and they kind of miss family. So, and we're missing them too. So we're gonna go out and see them. Um, and I have a girls night tonight and apparently tomorrow night because our friends group, one of the husbands is gonna be gone. And th these are off limits. These are for tonight. What? These strawberries. Oh. Jason's down here on the floor in case you're wondering. I don't know. What are you assuming, doing? I'm assuming you're fixing something. I'm trying to fix something. No, I just like oh. laying down on the floor. In I know. The kitchen. You're just taking a nap in here. Yeah, I just chilling um, on the floor. <laughs> but our, one of the husbands is going to be gone for game night tomorrow night. And so the girls are going to get together, maybe go to dinner. And then the guys are going to get together. And we come back to probably here and watch a movie. So we're uh, doing, I get to have two girls' nights. Um, and because Jason went out before me, he's now parked in the garage and I am parked outside. On my girls night tonight, I was kind of thinking, you know how I like that um, cottage cheese jello where you took cottage cheese and then you put the jello powder in and then some Cool Whip. I forgot Cool Whip. I'm right behind you. Okay. Oh. I forgot Cool Whip at the store. <laughs> I can I was, out. No, it's just um. We already have to take Abby to work in a couple hours. I know it's Krispy Kreme's 86th birthday and the second set of donuts like dozen donuts that you buy are gonna be 86 cents and I forgot to do that when we were out Ashley for a second time today and I'm can you take these up to my bedroom for me she's like trying not to be on camera so she she thinks that if she's not on camera she's not held accountable is that correct 
I got you. What? <laughs> yeah, that's exactly what she was, like the mentality. This is for my car. I saw that. To we get put the it together for you. I know, it's a good idea. We had one of those yellow ones, remember, from your Honda Pilot? Yeah, I don't know where that went. But you need a bougie one for your Tesla. I didn't know I had one. What do you mean I had one? Remember we got one that was a little yellow thing like that to get the window years ago. Oh, years ago. Yeah. I have never used it, so I don't know. I don't even know where it is. Exactly. I don't know where I it don't is. I don't either. Obviously, I don't have it anymore. So I got to clean these and put what these in the freezer. These are boob ice packs. They're not really. I don't know if they're, they're not for boobs, but they're, they're I was going to say, like. But it's. I can't put them on. I was going to make like a Timu joke. It is Timu. Order. I know. I was going to make a joke. Do you not dare to say you your joke? You can edit it out. <laughs> His joke is not appropriate. That, is, that joke is not staying in. <laughs> it's not appropriate at all. I am going to wash these up though. Just a little bit. A little mild soap and water. And then get these frozen. I did start my... Um, one of my treatments has to be done four days before my surgery. So today is officially four days before my surgery. And I, it's the Muprosin, it's basically Bacterban. Um, and you stick it up your nose and in your ear canal and in your belly button. And it's supposedly where, um, not supposedly, it is where a certain type of bacteria, and I forget the kind, um, but that's where it grows. And you wanna make sure that you kill it with the antiseptic. Um, in order to not have bacteria present during surgery. So I did that this morning. It's not pleasant, but it's also like not horrible. Oh, you did do it? Yeah, it's just the, the, that one. I think I do it twice each day. And then starting on, I believe Monday, I do the HIPAA cleanse, HIPAA cleanse, I guess, um, in the shower. And I have to take the shower twice a day those days. The day before and the well I take two showers the day before and then a shower the morning of my surgery and do the cleanse again so I'm just trying to make sure I re read through all the instructions for everything so I don't mess up and not have oh and I, I forgot to tell you that maybe I did I talked to the nurse uh, physician's assistant again yesterday and they kept I kept thinking they were calling in the wrong products for my um, prescriptions. Apparently my Muprosin and Bacterban are the same thing. So <laughs> I already had it. I just didn't have the HIPAA cleanse because it wasn't a prescription and I didn't know that when I went. So I also apparently need to make some more Ninja Creamies. I need to, oh that was Jason's. So let me put that now. Um, Oh, I don't, you really color coordinate it like that? Uh, I just know what my lid is. All right, I won't use blue ones. So I'm gonna make, maybe, I don't need to do it today. I don't need to do it today, but maybe Sunday or Monday. I'll make a whole bunch of them and put them in the freezer. That way um, it's made the way I want. She's come from the wild room. We don't see her very often. She's going back. <laughs> we literally don't see her very often. <laughs> she comes for food. She's truly like a, a cat or something. I don't know. She just comes for food and comfort, which is very rare. Uh, like a yeah. what? Like what kind of animal does that? Only you comes know, cats for. Sometimes do that. They just come yeah, they stay hidden until they want food or. Bunnies. But no bunny, whatever. All right, Dana wants me to uh, tell you what I'm doing with the dryer washer here. So, like many people, like all people. We get this ring mold down here, if you can see. Especially here in Washington, um, the, you know, it, just the conditions, the environment and everything leads to mold. And we always joke that if you leave a cookie out on the counter, it might get softer, not harder. Um, whereas like, you know, Utah, Arizona, places like that, things just dry out and shrivel up. But, uh, so what we gotta do is just get this out of there clean it up so I'm gonna kind of work on that uh, we did a good job for quite a while like wiping things down and keeping it clean but it's just you know it happens it's normal it's part of maintenance of life so I'll show you what I'm gonna do I took some uh, it said to get white vinegar we didn't have it so I did apple cider vinegar there's a little bit left in the pantry just not very much 
Oh, maybe there's some in the pantry. Um, anyway, it's gonna let it soak for a little bit, then we'll wipe it out, kind of clean it up. I know we did some things before. I think baking powder helps with stuff. I'm gonna clean it up. I'll show you. Here is a before. Looks just nasty. It's this little gunk down there, you know, just on the rim, the gasket. Oh, more up there. I'm gonna get scrubbing. Put it in there. You put it in there and like it's already like foaming up. It's foaming up. A little baking soda, vinegar. Can't huh. hear you when the fan's on. Oh, well, it's foaming up, a little baking soda and vinegar. I'm just going to take this little thing. Can you hold it or something? Yeah. Yeah, see, it just bubbles up. Good. Who's the lucky girl right now, Ash? Me. Tell them what happened. What uh, day is it? There are 86 cents. Cents. For the second dozen. I kind of parked crappy, didn't I? Yeah. Um, did I really park like that? Yeah, we but we also got pizza for dinner yeah. before mom's girls night and what else did we get a bunch of groceries we got some ham yeah. went to the bank right yep. okay back at home we've had dinner and I am trying something because I'm trying to healthier fruit dip I've got strawberries cut up for my um, game night tonight not game night just girls getting together. And I wanted to try something. Okay, so you guys know that I like cottage cheese. And I like cottage cheese jello. So I thought, why not try and make a cottage cheese dip? Because I love fruit with cottage cheese. Yeah, she's testing out the little spinner from this morning. So, here's what I did. I got Cool Whip cottage cheese and the jello packet. And I have blended it up. And I'm dipping strawberries in it so it's like a high protein dip for fruit and it tastes really good i think i need to add a little bit more of the powder because i just added some more um cottage cheese i kind of did a test batch with like that much and it's actually pretty good so i'm going to put a little bit more of this in and then whip it up a little bit more and then we're going to put it in a cute bowl to take over okay it's pretty good i like it a lot I might keep adding more jello flavoring other times, but um, that is good enough for this one. Plus this one has the sugar in it. Um, I need to get the sugar free one, but that one is already made more of a mess than I wanted. And this little blender of mine is on its last legs. <laughs> I might get one of those little magic bullet ones because I do want to start creating more things with my cottage cheese, but I, this little blender just doesn't get it as creamy as I like. There's still a lot of texture to it. Um, not like little lumps, but there's texture to it that it kind of, you know, kind of bugs you. The Cool Whip takes it away from this recipe or whatever. The Cool Whip helps to kind of cream it, but. Bye. Okay, I'm at my friend's house, but look what's right behind me. Can you see it? I'm gonna go here soon. There is a bear back there. Where did it go? Shoot, where? Oh, there he is. There he is. Oh, where did he go? Oh, he's gone. So we were out here talking, and uh, all of a sudden, because <laughs> we've been on the lookout for other dogs, because my friend is out here walking her dog, and uh, so she was kind of watching and making sure there wasn't another dog in the neighborhood, because her dog doesn't like it, and all of a sudden we're like, bear, there's a bear. So I'm gonna go around and see if I can see it. I know I'm not wearing my seatbelt. I'm just gonna go around the block here. See if I can see it. Like, bears have been down. There's not much food up in the hills, so they've been down in neighborhoods like crazy this season. It's like the worst it's ever been. And there's just mama bear. I think it's a mama bear with her baby cubs as well. They're just having a hard time finding food this late in the season. It's usually just like, very early spring. Ooh, I'm probably gonna pass it. Let's turn it around and see if I can find it. Don't want it to hit my car though. I'm back at home. Ended up running into a friend as I was searching for the bear and the bear was gone. Um, but I was telling my friend to go inside. Um, we just saw a bear over at Stacy's house, like bear and mama cubs, just right, 
like Ooh. two, three houses down from Stacy's house. That's dangerous. And Stacy was outside with Poppy, and she was like, "Get Poppy inside! Hurry, hurry!" And Eleanor ran back to her car, and then I came around the corner to go find the bears again, like in my car. And Colleen was outside, and I was like, "Colleen, you need to go inside." And her friend had her dog out, and she's like, "I'm going. I gotta get back inside because it's right. It was right between Stacy's uh, and Colleen's or whatever." It's, anyway, it's dangerous with the uh, cubs. Yeah, mama bears and their cubs, they don't play games. But I'm gonna sign off with you guys. I had a great night with my girlfriends, had excellent conversations, excellent snacks. They loved my dip. They thought it was great. In fact, it's right back there. Can you get it for me? And uh, they're like, that's made out of cottage cheese. And one of them does the cottage cheese with um, ranch and does it as her dip. I'm gonna make that next, but I'm gonna get a better blender. Um, because I don't like the texture of it when it's been blended up, but I know that you can get a better texture if you use like a magic bullet or a different kind of food processor. So I'm going to see you guys next time. We're getting closer to my surgery day. I might do like a, a video of like all my baggy shirts, like what they look like now. And then oh, you should do it before and after. Yeah. And then we'll show you after what those same shirts look like. Everyone likes before and after. Cause I already have shirts that I can't wear anymore cause they're already too baggy. But then like, we're going to fix the ladies and everyone like, and when I told people tonight that I was having the surgery done, they were like, Oh, I love that you call them your ladies. And I'm like, yeah, they're my lady friends. We're going to lift them up. <laughs> so Maybe I'll do that video here in the next few days as I kind of work through my nerves as getting ready for this um, surgery. Look how bright it is in here. Good thing I have a little white Tesla. Look how bright it is. It's it like is 10 o'clock at night. It reflects everything. Yeah, it does. Anyway, okay, take care of you guys. Easy, easy on our tiptoes.